Hello everybody, so it is Vlogmas day one and I'm super excited to be doing this this year. You guys are kind of on like a weird setup for right now just because I'm like running around like crazy today. Today's not a good day for Vlogmas to start, I'm so busy. Um, but I talked about this a little bit on my Twitter, but basically the way I'm going to be doing Vlogmas is posting every five days. So they're kind of like mini weeks in my life, but like Vlogmas edition. So I'll definitely be explaining this more like throughout the video. It's just like today's super, super busy, like I said. Um, I just got back from work. It's like 5 p.m. I'm done with classes for the day, obviously, and I need to get work in. I have a take-home test that's due tomorrow and a paper that's due tomorrow, and I have an event in like two hours, a little bit less. Um, it's like the luminaries that my campus does every year, so I'll definitely be showing you guys around that because it's so pretty, and yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoy this. In <laughs> We'd also like to thank Advancement and their students who labeled the luminaries this afternoon. Does this look like it was shot on the DSLR and not an iPhone? So it is day two of Vlogmas, if you could not already tell. Um, so I didn't really get a chance to sit down yesterday and just kind of explain what I was doing. I did like really briefly, um, but basically I am in school until the 17th of December and I'm crazy busy just with like projects and finals and stuff like that. So for the first couple weeks, for sure, I'm going to be doing Vlogmas in groups of five. I think I'm going to continue doing that throughout just to be consistent. Um, but the quality and like production of the vlogs will get much better once I get home Basically, there's just not a lot of things that I can vlog here besides like updates on how my life is going and Schoolwork and stuff like that just because I can't I mean, I guess I could but I'm not going to vlog in class or Vlog when I'm working or something like that I am also going to try to do a giveaway at the end of every episode of vlogmas So there should be five total and yeah, so today um, as you guys saw earlier, I just got up, I went to class, um, and then I went to Starbucks for literally like four or five hours and just did homework. I had a take-home test that I had to do, and then I went and had a bunch of meetings with like different advisors and professors because I'm considering changing my major, which if that goes through, I'll obviously tell you guys all about that, but I'm not going to talk about it if it's not happening. Um, and then I just did some errands, and I honestly took a nap. I fell asleep for like an hour. I don't even remember falling asleep. Um, and now it's about 8 p.m. So I'm going to make some mac and cheese and I have a comedy show to go to tonight and then I'm going out with some friends later. So I will take you guys along for as much of that that is appropriate to take you along for. Look at how good that looks. So I just finished getting ready. Um, obviously for the like comedy part, I'm going to be wearing a jacket because in my opinion, this is a bit much, but for going out, this is what I'm wearing. So I figured I'd do a quick outfit of the night. This bodysuit is from American Apparel. I have a bralette underneath from Aerie. And then I'm just wearing these dark green, I don't know if you can see the color, high-waisted pants from H&M. And then for shoes, I'm just gonna be wearing my Nike Superstars. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Hey everybody, so it is day three of Vlogmas, looking a little rough, but we're still kicking. Um, I just got up this morning and had breakfast, I got a bagel, um, and now I'm at Starbucks for probably the fourth time this week, and I'm probably gonna do four hours of homework today, hopefully. I'm trying to get ahead in some of my classes because if I do like projects before our final block time then I don't have to take the final so my goal is to like get those done so that my final week is a little bit easier um, but that's basically all I've done today I went to the mail room I got a check from Poshmark Poshmark literally saves my life if you guys need an app to sell like your old clothing or you just like want to buy used clothing. I buy a lot from Poshmark actually because it's a lot cheaper. And as long as you like look into it and like look into the seller, it's I've never really had an issue. 
Um, and so I've been selling a lot of my stuff on there if you guys don't already know. If you want to make an account, I'll have my information down below. You can get like $5 off your first purchase. I'll probably be talking about it later in the week because I have a lot more stuff I need to upload. So basically whenever I hit like a certain amount of money, I just like request a check and they send it to my PO box at school, which is amazing, especially with the holiday season coming up. And then I also got a package from my mom. She sent me a pair of pants. I left these at home like hanging up in like our laundry room because I couldn't put them in the dryer and I completely forgot to bring them back with me and I need them for a photo shoot next weekend which I will be taking you guys along to. Shout out to my mom for paying to send these to me. I felt so bad. So I'm just gonna go do homework for a couple hours and I will talk to you guys after. So it's been a little bit. I just like came back and relaxed for a little bit and now I'm getting ready to go out to dinner. Um, I just got changed. I'll show you guys my outfit in a second, but I'm just going to fix my hair quickly and I thought I'd talk to you guys while I do so. Basically, I'm not doing anything like super fancy. I'm just kind of curling the ends of my hair with my flat iron. It's super simple and it's really going to feel like semi frizzy hair like me just because it's a really easy and quick way to just like style your hair. I'm obsessed with it just like flat iron the first like third of your hair and then you turn the iron around and just like flip the hair through it and it creates a really nice like ringlet here if you can see but it falls out really naturally and I just love the way that it looks um, if you're curious about the straightener that I'm using honestly it's from irresistible me I worked with them on a video probably two years ago at this point and I still love it Part of the reason I like doing this so much is just because it's really simple and it kind of looks different every time you do it so I think in my opinion it looks really natural which I like um, and it's just it literally takes three minutes it's so fast as you guys can see um, I like blow through my hair um, and you can take like bigger sections or smaller sections obviously um, it just like is so fast and easy and I feel like it looks so good Sorry for the absolute gross, like, dirty background behind me. So I'm just wearing this bell sleeve top. I think this is from TJ Maxx. I stole it from my sister, so I'm not entirely sure where she got it. And then I'm just wearing some black jeans with holes in the knee um, from Windsor. And then I'm going to be wearing my Adidas Superstars with it. Super casual, but still, like, semi put together is what we're going for. So, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy, and I will talk to you tomorrow. Hey guys, so it is day four of Vlogmas, and I'm looking really, really rough. I'm sorry about that. Um, but today is kind of similar to every other day, just homework and coffee and stuff like that. This time I'm going to coffee with my friend Kelsey, and we're exploring this new place that's like 30 minutes away from my school. So hopefully it's kind of cute. Um, yeah, I've never been, she's never been, but I have like good expectations for it. I called the owners, or not like the owners, like the number on the Yelp page just to like get some more information and it seems perfect. So I guess the next time it, you see us, it'll be there and yeah, it'll be good. I'm excited. <laughs> This is so much cuter than I expected. So it is a lot later now. I'm kind of talking quietly, but hopefully you can hear me okay. Um, obviously, you guys saw the coffee shop that me and Kelsey went to. It was so cute. They had like a little festive market going on. Um, if I didn't explain that earlier and it was just so cute and such a good atmosphere and I'm so glad that we went So we stayed there for like five hours I know these vlogs have just like sucked because it's just been me going to coffee shops and doing homework um, But then we just like drove home and we ran a couple errands for her We found the weirdest house in the world. It was like 
Christmas decor outside, but they like stacked boxes. I'll insert a picture like right here of it. It was just like we thought it was the funniest thing. Um, and then I came home and continued to do some work. I applied for two internships today, so hopefully I hear back from like one of them. So fingers crossed. And then I just got some Qdoba from campus and I'm so excited to eat this. I am starving, so yeah, I think that's pretty much it for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the new coffee shop and not just Starbucks. Hopefully tomorrow will be more interesting as I say every day, but yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Hey everybody, so it is day five of Vlogmas, so it's like the last day of this episode. Um, yeah, so this morning I got up, I had three classes and I just like went to all of them, did my thing, I came back, showered, kind of got ready because I don't know, I just like looked in the mirror and I felt so gross, you know, and you just like feel so disgusting in your own skin and you just want to like shower and restart. Um, that was me earlier and I'm about to go get coffee with my friend Evan. He called and was like, what are you doing? And I was like, coffee? So I said I wasn't going to get any coffee today. I don't think I said that like on the vlog, but I said it to myself and I was not strong, but it's okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and get coffee and then when I get back, I'm gonna show you guys some of the like decorations in my room and stuff like that and it'll be fun. Okay, so I am back now. The lighting probably changed quite a bit. I don't know, maybe it didn't. I might be able to like edit it. Um, I got my coffee. If you guys are wondering, I'm obsessed with the pumpkin coffee from uh, Duncan. It is so good. My friend Emily like, not made me get it one time, or like I tried some of hers, something like that. I don't know. She got me onto this and I like am addicted to it. Um, so yeah, coffee was much needed. I feel a lot better. I feel very me, very zen. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys around my room and then I'm going to like end off the vlog So I obviously didn't do a lot this year But the only things that I really added was this little like snow garland from Target and then these just two little stockings that are also from Target. If you wanna see a full room tour, um, if you haven't already, I will link it down below for this year and my one from last year if you guys are curious. So walking out into our common space area, we just have like two really small decorations. The first one is this like Charlie Brown inspired tree. It's just really cute and like funny to have in a dorm. And then I have a pillow from Target on this white fluffy chair that just says ho ho ho. Okay, so before I end the vlog, one, I just wanna say thank you guys for watching, um, just because I know it's not been super fun, but I have hopefully a really big, exciting like announcement in the next day or two, so it should be in the next vlog. It might not happen, but fingers crossed it does. Um, and like I said, I want to do a giveaway at the end of like every vlog, so today's is just gonna be kinda small just because like, I don't know, I wanna like work my way up. I don't wanna give away the best stuff now. Anywho, so the first thing I have is this set of makeup brushes, and this is a Gen Beauty exclusive pack. I got this at Generation Beauty. I just like don't need any more brushes. I have so many, so I figured I'd give it to one of you who might need one. So this set just has a concealer, highlight, and eyeshadow brush, so it's like a pretty good basic kit if you don't have any. And then the next thing I'm giving away is two NYX pigments. Um, this one is like a kind of a coppery color and this one is like a lilac color. These are so so pretty I just like have so much makeup. I feel like I should share some of it with you guys and then the last two things one is this essence eyeshadow and this is like a really pretty mocha brown color and I love the formula of these they're so nice um, So I think you guys will really like that and that's also a little bit more wearable and then I also have just this Per Cosmetics mascara. I love Per Cosmetics and actually it might be Pure, I don't remember. Um, but I love their brand and like all of their ethical stuff. So hopefully you guys will enjoy this. So I will have all of the rules and stuff in the down bar right now just because I'm not like mentally coherent enough to try to like list them all off. So it'll be pretty quick, pretty easy. 
um, just like basic rules make sure you check the down bar I will be checking everything like if it says you have to be subscribed or like following me on Instagram or something like I will check um, and yeah so hopefully one of you enters and wins I'd love to pass this off to somebody and if you guys are interested in like more information or more like staying up to date with my life I will have all my social media like over here and in the down bar I've been posting on Instagram and Twitter like crazy lately I love interacting with you guys on Twitter so definitely follow me if you aren't already and I think that's it so I will see you guys in the next episode bye